Hi, this is Nicole Lee with Health, Beauty, and More. And I'm going to do another beauty segment here. For those of you that have fine hair like mine, and you want a little updo on top, you want to do something rather than just ratting your hair, well, these little spongy things with a comb, you stick right in your hair, and they'll give you that extra volume that you want. And I'm going to show you how I would do it. I would just take the hair that I have from back here, the crown, and brushing it forward now. And just leave it like that. No, no I'm just kidding. Um, brushing it forward. Kind of grabbing the hair. Like that. And then take this little comb dealy and you want to stick it in the hair that you grabbed just before that part or near it. Try to center it as best you can. That might not be centered but with the mirror. It's easier to see what you're doing. Anyway, at this point, you want to take the hair in your hands, kind of spreading it out over that sponge. And what I did with this hairspray was I sprayed some of the hairpins. I use Kenra. I like for fine hair, I like to use light hold anyway. Anyway, this is what I'm doing is I twisted my hair so that I can secure it with bobby pins. Kind of going towards the sponge with the bobby pins. I'll, all I have is one pin in there right now. And you can really play with your hair a lot and smooth it out if you have a mirror. But I suggest doing more than one pin and trying to make it look as natural as possible. So you might have to play with it a little bit with the mirror and lay it down and then pin around that. Or take some more hair from the sides if you have more than I do that would look better to pin around this area. So I'm going to put one more pin in without a mirror. So it'll look better if you do it with a mirror. But this just gives you an idea of how one would do this. And if you have more hair than I do, more power to you. If you really want to thicken it, you can use a thickener and hairspray. You can rat it, tease it a little bit to make your hair look like you have more hair. You do the same thing in the back. A little light hairspray to hold it. I have no idea what it looks like because I don't have a mirror right now. Oh, I have a little one right here. That's right. Huh. It's not too bad. I think I'd fix this piece right here that's kind of laying funny. And tighten that back a little more. Make it a little better that way. There. That might be better. And the same thing maybe with this piece right here. Because there is sometimes these pieces don't always run the way you want them to when you pin. And I'm going to try to, maybe I'll do a little ratting on that piece too, and then just pin it. Okay, so at least from the front you can see I have a sort of a pompadour 
on top. I'm bending down to see what you think. I'll turn around. I don't I don't know how the back's gonna look because of the way I did it without looking the first time, but from the front it does look different. It's a different look. So what do you think? It's probably worth trying it on your hair. It might give you that boost of volume that you need. Hope you enjoyed the video with another beauty tip from Nicole Lee at Health Beauty and More. And be sure to subscribe. Talk to you soon. Have a great day. And without glasses, it probably looks better. But I don't have contact lenses right now, so I'm just going to go with these. That way I can read everything, see everything clearly. Take care. Bye-bye.